Lena. 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 I said, I said, Lena. She said, Lena. Well, My next guess, Lena Moros. Was that right? Yes. How would you say it in Russian? Lena Moros. Moros. Oh, you got to roll the R. Oh I got to roll. Oh my God. Moros. Moros. My Moros. God. Who is this woman? Man? Yeah, you look great. You look great. Oh, so, shit. Lena. I have split personality. Look at this. I have blue hair. No. No, I have the blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh -uh. Okay. okay. Keeping us honest. Let's Keeping go. us honest. So, so uh, let's let's start with Mother Russia. Oh, Mother Russia. It's uh, I lived there till I was seventeen. Till you were seventeen. Yes, and I. Uh, and what happened? Well, they my parents uh, brought me here, and thank God to them. And look at this. Uh, take we're, away your hand. We're in your art. Oh, yeah, oh, we're okay. my art. Okay, yeah. there we are. Yeah. So, so uh, who do we have here? Here we have Carmine, somebody I met on the street, on the corner of La Brea and Hollywood. He was transgender, uh, cross-dresser, in drug, and I came up to him and befriended him. And uh, I devoted two years of my life painting him. Wow. Yeah. He's an incredible guy. What, and, uh, what kind of paint are we talking about here? Uh, watercolor, uh, paper, big, uh, huge sizes. And watercolor on paper? Yes. Okay, no and acrylic, no oil? No, 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 no. No? I'm too old for that. Too old. <laughs> but watercolor, no, actually watercolor is the one that's so delicate that people finally abandon it. Well, I'm not the delicate type, but you know, uh, <laughs> all, uh, and, and oil how, is very difficult for me. How big is this? Uh, is it a uh, large piece of paper? It's huge. It's. Uh, Huge piece of paper. It's uh, six feet high. Seventy-two uh, inches. Seventy-two uh, inches wide. long. Wide. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Geez, that's yeah. that's that's yeah, a big piece. Big okay. So, and what years? What years were you uh, working with the uh, homeless transgender? Uh, I worked on him uh, for two years, and basically I dressed him, and um, photographed him and painted. Used yeah. him as a model. As a model. Yes. And so did you uh, uh, have him in your studio? Yes, in my studio I have about eight uh, hours of conversation with him and um, him talking about his life. And he's, you know, older dude, he's like 72. Oh man. So he's been where, around. Uh, where is he now? Here, he's still my friend. Still in Los Angeles? He's still you, in Los you've Angeles. You've moved on as, for as far as subject matter? Well, yeah, now it's <laughs> transgender girls, but whatever. But um, so, so my main muse. So you, you, you left the Soviet Union, not really Russia, right? Yes. Russia was being occupied by the, yes, Soviet, yes. the Soviets, but, but that's over now, right? Now it's just another big free now country, it's, uh, right? Some do, you, do you ever guns. go back to visit? I went once. You went once? I went once. Yeah, not, not again? No, I don't feel like There's it, nothing you know? there? It's a gangster is, country. Is, um, it's a what? A gangster country? Yeah, it's a gangster country. Well, that's kind of what America afraid. aspires to be, don't you think? Well, yes. That's yeah. why they're such a good friends. <laughs> okay, let's not go into it. Let's so, 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 yeah. so, so uh, okay, well then, what are we looking at here? <laughs> oh, this is uh, layman workers, uh, drill workers. It's a bunch of photographs I found on a garage sale uh, there, um, uh, cable layers. And oh, really? I, yes, and I just did a series of... And again, these are large watercolors. Huge uh, watercolors. Wow, wow, wow. And uh, how do you mount a huge watercolor? You don't bother framing something I this large. I don't mount them. I just no. uh, paint them on the wall and on the floor and on the wall again and having fun with it. When they're exhibited, though, how are they, how are they displayed? I don't care. You don't care? I don't care. You just, just say, curator, do your business. Yes, or pin it to the wall and do whatever. You don't because, care? Because uh, to frame them is uh, very difficult. Okay. And you just, you found a box of photos? Yeah. And, and use that as a subject? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it, it, do, you, do you find the blue collar workers heroic? Is there, what's, what's, what, what is your motivation here? Um, because it's, they're just workers and uh, 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 they, they are heroic, you're right, absolutely right, you put it nicely, yeah. And uh, for me, doing something very simple, something very um, routinely ordinary is heroic. As opposed to, you're in the middle of the west side, and so you have all the glamour of the entertainment industry, 
So to, oh, to paint somebody heroic, I mean, it's to some, well, somebody common is, is heroic, is like there's no, there's no attention being paid. Thank you, yes. Yeah? And that's why I loved uh, Karman because he was, uh, uh, he wasn't playing the part as a transgender or gay man, he was just playing himself, doing, I mean, living himself. As, as who he was? As, Carmine yeah. as Carmine. Yeah. And okay. these uh, guys as... And that build, that, that yeah. how to get your respect, be who you are. Yeah. Yeah? Exactly. No Thank you. No yeah. glamour. No glamour. Yeah. Let's see what else. But it's very, I think it's very sexy. What? The guy. The, the workers? Okay, the workers. The, 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 the cable layers? <laughs> yeah. Yeah? Yeah, from my those are, side. Those, those are your, your, your beefcake, cheesecake, yeah? Yeah, okay. I have to, you know, do, feel something. Okay. <laughs> She has a pulse, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so what are we looking at here? Uh, this is my new series devoted to um, theater in Tokyo. Mm. Uh, uh, this theater exists for hundred, more than a hundred years. All the uh, roles played by women. And it's basically a Japanese perception of Western culture, Western uh, art. Western, uh, Western opera. Have you have you visited Japan? No. No. But when I was about six, seven years old, I saw a documentary, and it's absolutely. Wait, you saw what? Nuts. A documentary. A documentary about this theater. Okay. And I had to get uh, get it out of my system, get rid of it. You know? Oh, okay. So, so it's been in there a long time. Yeah. You want to just. So I also use uh, photographs. As as source material. As source material. But again, there is watercolor. A, watercolor pen ink uh, pencil and uh, i always do everything from um, photographs because my belief is that reality is much weirder than any imagination keep keep it keep it a uh, stat and, and you have okay. a static image too so yeah, yeah and you don't have the model moving around quit yeah. moving no, none of that none of that i think so so where I, okay this is more like a uh, an art kind of tech question but when you're making large, I think of watercolors in these little tubes. Oh, four dollars for the phthalo blue. When you're doing this much, where do you get a big tube of watercolor? Uh, tube. I'm, what am I going to tell you all the secrets? Ah! <laughs> I was trying to pry one out yeah, of you there. Yeah, I, uh, I use uh, background paper, roll of huge papers uh -huh. for photographers, and uh, I'm just. I guess, it's, it seems to be a large amount of expensive paint. So no, it's cheap. It's cheap? Yeah, I can do uh, expensive. Give me the money. I will do expensive, you okay. know, but it's cheap. I d dissolve it with the water. Oh, really? Okay, yeah. so you know, oh, the pigment. You, you dissolve the pigments? Yes. Oh, okay, yes. so you're working straight with it. Now, yeah. do you mix the pigments to get the right color, or are you just, are you worried more about going after this photograph and using the colors that already I, exist? I do just the uh, brightest colors available. The brightest I'm not uh, uh, thinking about much... Uh, about no. paint and color and how aesthetically beautiful it is. Do you consider yourself? Am I smart? Do I do I sound smart? You sound. God. I'm 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 intimidated. Okay, I'm intimidated. Good. Okay, yes. so <laughs> so so do you consider yourself a painter or an artist? Badass. A badass. <laughs> you consider yourself a bad. Okay, Lena Badass is yes. with us, and uh, there's not going to be any messing around. So well, let's see what else Lena Badass brought us. Okay, let's see. What else? Oh, can you? Yeah. Oh, look what was behind so me. So this is. Is this Carmine? Carmine. This is about uh, twice as uh, big as human size. Wow. And all the teeth, the stomach of his goodness is there. And uh, if you see, I don't make fun of him. It's. Um, it's a very straight portrait. Very straight and it's beautiful and I admire him. And you, you, are you looking for the poetic? Why paint and not photograph? Well, what, why paint? Yeah. Because I want to exercise my, uh, I say, hotness, whatever I feel. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I want to move it. You so know? so, so um, where is the poetry, though? If it's there, it's there. Somebody said it's very lyrical, and it's very true. That's how I feel. I can't fake it. I can't be phony about it, you know. You know, you're not a tight renderer, and yet you, you render quite well in a very loose style. Yeah. Is that something, did, now, did you study that at some 
Soviet Academy, or have you just developed this style uh, over years of practice? I see over years of practice, and then uh, it's very. Um, I was prepared to be book illustrator in Russia, oh, so okay. I just wanted to put illustration into much more grandiose style. When, when when does an illustration actually become art? Well, it was art. Oh, you consider illustration art? Yeah. Okay, because a lot of a lot of fine art, a lot of these theory but people. But I wanted, yeah, but I wanted to put it in this uh, huge scale because I'm arrogant, you know. So I want to <laughs> do it big, you know. You know, every artist is arrogant, and one admitted it. <laughs> I am vain and arrogant, absolutely self-possessed. Yes, yeah, self-possessed. Yes. You know, it's it's the true nature of the artist yeah. to have that um, that commitment to oneself. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, and where is your studio located? Uh, Adams Boulevard. Adams uh, Boulevard. It's, uh, the poor part of uh, Culver City. It's east of La Brea, so it's So, east Culver City? East, east, east <laughs> Culver City. It's closer ECC. To <laughs> There's East LA and East Culver City in there. Yeah, it's like, uh, yeah, it's east of La Brea. She's, so an, it's east, <laughs> east of, e, she's an E lab, east of La Brea. Yeah. yeah. So, is it the tough part of town? Uh, we've been there for 25 years. It's tough, but everybody likes us, me especially, because they think I'm crazy. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. When you say us, who else is us? My husband, who is an art restorer. He's an art restorer. Yeah. And he has, to, he has his own set of headaches. Yes. We could get him on the show. And, me. And, yeah, me. Well, yeah here. here at the top. Forget the torn uh, Damien Hirst print. Oh. This is the, uh, this is the top <laughs> headache. Okay. Okay. So um, do we have more art? Oh, What's, yes. What are we looking at here? This is a drill. This is, uh, without being too humble, my favorite piece I ever created. Really? Yes. And how big is this? Big. How as, big is as, this? As, uh, uh, High as high as you are. As high as, as I am. High, I'm I'm sober. I'm not that high. <laughs> uh, how you how you say as uh, tall? As, as tall, tall as me. Yes. Damn, I, I knew you get it. I need translator. I, <laughs> we we couldn't book a translator. Uh, yeah. He was he was busy. He's at the White House. Uh, so. Oh, oh <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> and um, this is a drill. That's a drill. Just and a drill. A drill. Why uh, is it pink? Because I felt like it, you know, I just felt repeated pink, you know, and with the watercolor is very difficult, you, know, you can't control it, and I'm a control freak. So it's, you know, usually I have several renditions of painting. So this happened. Just once. Just once. Just once. For drill. And you're happiest with the drill. No, I have about seven drills, but this is... This I is the best drill. This is the best drill. And it's just, it's just, this, <laughs> this is your masterpiece. Yeah, You're going to drill it into me that this is your masterpiece. Oh my God, yes. Okay. Uh, yes. So, so now, where do you, where have you exhibited your art that people might have seen your art? That's a hard question. Is it a long list? Uh, it's a very spotty list, a uh, long where, list. Where was, your, where was your favorite show that you were in? Uh, Museum. M U Z Z E U M. Yes, M U Z on also on uh, Adams. Uh, and that's also on Adams. Yeah. Uh, in the bad part of town. Yes, and uh, right bad. now I have uh, one painting of Carmine exhibited in Basel. Basel. In Basel, Switzerland, right Basel, now. Basel, Switzerland. The city of Basel, Switzerland. City of. Right now, it's a, it, it's a projection, right? It's a projection on the wall. How did you How did you manage that? I submitted my work. You submitted it to? Uh, to this gallery, to this... Uh, to some thing. organizers of a yeah, show. Yeah. And now Carmine, your watercolor of Carmine is being projected yes. onto the walls yes. in Basel, Switzerland. And they didn't send me tickets. No come. tickets to the fair, no, folks. No. no tickets to the fair. We just want your art. Get out of here. <laughs> so, um, so what's next for you? I'm uh, doing the Japanese uh, show, I'm preparing Japanese, and I have one woman show, two. Two, uh, two women. Two. Both of you. Both of me. I have split personality now, but I... Uh, and, uh, who, who, who's the other woman? Oh, Lena Maros, but she's a ah! <laughs> she, she crazy. Where, where, where's the show? Uh, one is Al Altadina. In Altadina. Altadina. The other one is... I forgot. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm not prepared. 
If I'm, okay, if they went to, do you have a website they could go to and see uh, where, yes, what, what you're up to? Yes, they will. What is your website? Uh, Lenamarosart.com. Lenamarosart. L e n a m o r o s s a r t. Dot com. Yes. Com. C o m. Lena Maros. Thank you for being on Modern Art Blitz. Oh, thank God, it's over. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back <sighs> right after this. We're gonna go. <laughs>